Hello and welcome to The Future is 3D. Uh, my name is Jeff Christiana and this is our Glacier Steel 16 by 16 by 24 inches of build area. It's got a 16 by 16 mix 6 plate. It's got a silicon based heating pad with 2000 degree Fahrenheit insulation. <clears throat> We've got 12 millimeter bearings and 12 millimeter bars that hold the plate rock solid in place. That slides very easy, extremely smooth, no vibration, no wobble. <clears throat> We've got uh, updated end stop that's fully adjustable. We've got ramps 1.4 electronics. This model is wired for a dual head. We've got USB <coughs> out the back. We've got a lighted power switch fused system with a 40 with a 40 amp power supply. <coughs> Strong stepper NEMA 17 motors. We got a stainless steel frame construction. You can see some of the welds. Each frame is welded here at Calspell, Montana, and they are powder coated to your color choice. The uh, print head is still our old design on this video, but that, as of today, is going to be upgraded to our all-new aluminum, fully 100% metal head. They were also going to have a dual head model, which is also in development. That will be ready around the same time within the next couple of weeks, next week or so. I'm hoping uh, by this weekend we will have the new head design. The new head will be capable of reaching temperatures of 500 degrees Celsius, can reach 300 Celsius within three minutes. It'll have a 0.35 tip that will be exchangeable with any size you'd like. We will custom make those. Um, the, uh, this printer will be fitted with an LCD readout and a keypad. So you'll have full functionality of the printer without the use of a computer. You can generate your G-code, load it on an SD card, and select it with your, through the menu system and print. You can preheat your head, you can move all the axes, lots to come. And I will be putting out a video here probably in the next three days of this video um, with the new keypad and screen mounted on this side of the printer. We will also be putting out a video of our new control box. So all of our electronics are now going to be off the printer, all located in the control box with the display screen, with the keypad, with the power supply integrated in a laser cut, um, very stylish looking control box. And out of the control box, all of the connectors will run to this plate and there will only be connectors here. So your printer will just be the frame, motors, wires, and if you want another printer, different size, different model, you just move your control uh, connectors over to the other printer. Uh, you can build another printer and, and test it out. Um, it's fully modular. We'll all be offering the control box as a standalone unit for your own 3D printer that you design. So this is the Glacier Steel 16 by 16 by 24 and we'll be constantly making improvements and changes and updates every month 
and this is uh, very exciting and we will see you in the next video.